Sarasota Police Department putting $30,000 towards improving its surveillance cameras to prevent crime. The city has 84 surveillance cameras in various locations, 11 of which are monitored by Sarasota Police. 41 cameras are stationed in Newtown, including seven operated, operated by SPD. Some residents in that community feel they are being unfairly targeted, while others say the cameras make them feel safer. ABC 7's Adam Cellini explains their concerns. Wednesday's new beginnings meeting between police and community leaders started with good intentions, but ended like this. I really appreciate everybody being here. Unfortunately, because we can't have a civil conversation, I'm calling the meeting. They did not want to hear or entertain any conversation about how the black community in Sarasota is disproportionately targeted. Ruth Beltran is with the local activist group Answer Sun Coast and took this video of the meeting after raising questions about surveillance cameras. She says the cameras criminalize Sarasota's historic black community. Of course you're going to catch more people doing wrong things because that's where you are looking. That's where you have all of your efforts pointed to. And some agree the cameras can feel invasive, especially near residential areas. Us in Newtown, we have to uh, watch our step, walk on the eggshells. But 40-year-old Newtown resident Charles Reeves says he and others petitioned for those cameras, hoping it would curb crime along Martin Luther King Drive. It's safety. I'm 65 years old. Camera, I'd be glad to have cameras out here for my protection. Anybody that's have any kind of sense, we really know cameras will help. And in the video, other longtime residents can be seen defending police. When we agreed to have them cameras in and we have no had no problem when we bought it up in the community. Where these two people come from, I don't know. Now Reeves is frustrated the meeting ended without getting to other pressing issues. She got to first sit down and listen, but other people have to say before she keep going. She keep going. She won't let nobody else get there. We're at a cross. The conversation about these cameras also led to the question of why Sarasota police haven't started using body cameras for surveillance on themselves. Well, Chief DePino said there's still a lot of red tape surrounding that issue, and we can only assume that red tape is coming from the city commission, who has yet to allow the police department to start using the technology. In Newtown, Adam Cellini, ABC7, your Suncoast News.